Red Velvet by, no, I'm sorry. It's Oompa Oompa by Red Velvet. See how much I know? I don't, I don't know the song. I don't know the band. I apologize. But at least you get to watch first time reaction here. So never heard it. I don't edit this video either. And I messed up that intro. So that is for the record books. Let's see what else is going to happen here. So, um, there's uh, a lot of background singing going on there. I, I really like the, um, I like notes, you know, and I like progressions of music. And this song has a lot of notes vocally. And the first thing I want to do right now is watch them do this live. Um, but I can't, I'm not going to do that on this video. But, um, it sounds like somebody probably played this on a keyboard, the backing vocals, and then they they recorded those notes that were played on the keyboard. I would imagine, but I'm just assuming some things and taking a wild guess. But um, so far, it's a fun song, of course. Who wouldn't like it? But let's go back a little bit and, and listen to the backing vocals on here. It's pretty thick harmonies. Here we go. Ice cream.
Yeah, there it is. You know, I started this whole thing um, reviewing music. I've always loved music, had a, a deep passion for it, and played a lot of drums for a lot of live shows, local shows. So, um, mostly local. But, you know, three weeks ago this started out, and I got, I was turned on to black pink. And then through the comments and suggestions by the viewers, I went from black pink to BTS. And then once I was on the BTS journey, because it is a journey, because you really, um, with that band, just a lot that you're having to research and listen to, and it's, it is a journey. Um, but from that, the comment section, I found this song, or maybe from the Blackpink, but either way, in three weeks' time, I have come to Red Velvet here, and, you know, I'm not sure what to think about me listening to that, because I think it's a great song. I just feel a little bit strange, because I'm a middle-aged man. Like, if I went to their concert, would I be the only... I don't mean any kind of a weird offense by this. I'm just pointing out, would, would I perhaps be the only middle-aged male there? And um, I wonder what people would think about me. And, you know, I like the song a lot. Um, I don't know why I said what I just said about me being the middle-aged male there. But, you know, we're, I'm not editing this, and I probably should. But... Uh, I could see going, if I had a high school aged uh, daughter, I could see me going to be a chaperone with them to this. Um, other Beside all that, it's a good song, well written song, by the way. People writing this song know what they're doing. And the pre presentation's great, the girls can sing it. Um, you know, pretty good. Upbeat. How could you be in a bad mood listening to that? So, all right, that's long enough for this video, I think. Um, just rambling on. But, hey, it's fun. All right, so, Jeff, thanks for that suggestion. Uh, oh, remember, love your neighbors and love your pets. Let's see if Ansley's around. Ansley! Ansley! She's over there on the couch, but uh, I had her at work earlier, so she's tired. All right, we'll see you later.